Hey everybody, I'm Mary and this is my simple cottage life. You know, I was talking to Brian about that house yesterday and I was telling him if I could afford it, just living on Social Security and what I get for cleaning three days a week plus what I make from YouTube, I don't think I would rent that house out ever again. Now. I would certainly clean it up and repair the damage first. And I wouldn't let it get in such bad shape that it's only good for tearing down. I would keep it up, but I would not have people in it again. Because let me tell you, y'all, last night, after they left here, I slept better than I have in months and months since they've been there. I just felt really good about the fact that they were gone and I didn't have to deal with her screaming at me or that belligerent son of hers cussing people out or fearing that he's going to hurt one of my kitties. Y'all, I, I don't know what I would do if somebody actually killed one of my kitties. Now, Mr. Biggie, he didn't kill Mr. Biggie. Mr. Biggie died on the highway. And I was just devastated when I discovered that because that poor baby had a rough life and I fed him and I tried my best. Y'all go back and look at my videos. You'll see where he, he got to where he was coming closer and closer to me when I would put his food out. And I would have taken him in gr gladly. I think that bothered me more than anything they could have done to that house is the threat of harming one of my little kitties. I, I couldn't stand that. I couldn't stand that. Nope. But I would have to work awfully, awfully hard <laughs> trying to make my YouTube channel grow. I'm about 9,200, and I never in my wildest dreams thought I would get to that. I had, I didn't even dream I would get to that. And I am so thankful to all of y'all who have subscribed to my channel. I really am. You don't know how happy you've made me. You don't know how when I see that number I'm so pleased. I'm so proud. And I know that I need to work harder than ever because I truly need the money that this channel brings to me. That the ads that are that are placed on my videos the, the money that they might bring in to me right now I don't I make under two hundred dollars a month under two hundred but you know that's two hundred and that'll pay an electric bill so I am I'm blessed I'm blessed to have that so I'm gonna do my best maybe to come up with some better content or, or, I mean, you know, I don't have a whole lot of content, I guess. I've got cats that I show, I've got my garden I show, and my patio that I work on, and, but, but, you know, winter's coming, and I'll be able to be out here on the patio a little more, uh, but then when it gets really cold, I can maybe come out in the morning and have a cup of coffee. And hopefully I'll be able to do some more 
uh, lives because I, I really do like the lives and those who come to my life seem to enjoy them very much. We get to laugh with one another and have a good time and so I would like to do that. I, w I will do my best to try to do better with my channel because y'all I need it. I need the money and I need to, to, to figure out how to make it all a lot better. You know, I don't have the kind of content that's going to just zoom right up there and and be uh, viral. I had one. I had one that, that got, I think, something like 150,000 views. And I, I was thrilled. I was absolutely thrilled. But that's not going to happen to me all the time. Uh, I know that. And I'm happy with what I have. I am. But I need to do better. And um, I thank y'all who watch my videos. I thank you for watching the ads too because that's, that counts. That really counts. So you're going to have to bear with me a while because now, now my focus can't be on my patio and working out here with my curtains and my Timu flowers. Uh, it's gotta be repairing that house and I, I've done it before. Um, when we first bought that house, over, well over 20 years ago, you could stand in the living room and see the woods through the, through the uh, boards in the wall. And Bobby and a friend got out there and put uh, spray foam insulation in all those outer walls to insulate it. I'm sure it's kind of gone down quite a bit by now. You know, it, it settles after several years. It needs it again, but I can't afford that. Uh, and we built, we together built that living room over there. Uh, we built it. He put all those windows in and the doors in. He built that beautiful front porch. That's a 40-foot front porch out there. It's got a uh, chandelier with, with roosters uh, on it. I, I wish I, I will be able to show you that now. I'll be able to go over and show you what it was. But I had a beautiful front porch. I remember one time the male lady came up and she was standing there and she said, I could sit on this front porch all day long. That's a wonderful thing. That's a great compliment to get when you've worked really hard on something. So it's not like I don't know how to do these things. It's just that I'm older. Um, I'm a whole lot older and a whole lot uh, slower but I'm still as strong. Well, no, I'm not as strong, but I'm still pretty strong. I can still pick up things and pretty heavy things. Picked up all these blocks around here, remember? Made this sidewalk out here. So I can still do a lot. And uh, I've always been a painter, so I, I paint myself. And I uh, fill holes in walls. I plaster them. Uh, I can get it pretty again. I will. And this time, I promise you, promise you, I will thoroughly check out who these people are that want to rent my property, their income, their work um, history, where they've come from. Have they ever been evicted before? Cause, nope, I don't want them. Because uh, that, that's a warning sign for sure. Um, I, I'll, I'm going to try to do a whole lot better. I have made up a contract. No, it's not a contract. What it is is... I can't even think what it is now. It, it's a paper where you ask all these questions and they have to write them down and you take them and you follow up on all that information to see if it's true or not. And I'm going to do that. It might take a little longer to rent this place after I get it clean again and smelling good. 
I don't know what I'm going to do about that bathtub, and you should see the kitchen sink. I don't know what in the world happened to that kitchen sink, but I scrubbed a little bit on that this morning. I don't know how in the world. It's almost like it's almost like something was poured down in that sink that ate away at the enamel. I, I've never seen anything like that before. I, I couldn't figure for the life of me what in the world it is. And I sure don't want to have to have a new kitchen sink installed. That one's not very long, uh, very old. Anyway, the purpose of this video is to tell you, okay, I learned. I'm not going to say it won't ever happen again, but I'm going to say I will be better informed next time. And, and if this happens again to me, then it's on me. But right now, it's on them. And wherever they go in this world, they're going to take their problems with them. They're going to be the same somewhere else as they were with me. And I know that. And I feel sad for them that they don't understand that. I don't know what kind of reckoning they're going to come to. That they're going to say, hey, wait a minute. we got to change our attitude. We are not divas. We are not Karens and Kevins. Uh, we need to take care of our home that we are living in and not put it off on other people all the time when we mess up. You screw up, you learn to fix it, or you're just gonna keep screwing up. So thank y'all for watching my video that I posted on Saturday morning. I've gotten a lot of views and I've gotten some wonderful comments and some wonderful ideas from y'all. And I thank you very much. I just love y'all. You're so kind, you're so sweet. I couldn't have a better community of, of wonderful, uh, I'm gonna say men and women. I don't have many men on my page, uh, on my channel. I don't, they're mostly all women. And we all have a lot in common, we do. And isn't that wonderful all over the world how you can find people that have the same desires and likes and loves that we do so that's why i am so blessed so thank you for listening to me today i hope y'all have a great day and as always i hope god is good to you i'll see you soon bye bye